you have an individual walk with God. And God could be telling you something that he ain't telling somebody else because it's an individual thing. Oh, I need y'all to look at somebody and say, this is an individual. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, we, we not going to stand together in the judgment seat of God. You're going to be standing there right there by yourself. You're going to be, you got a wife, you got a husband, but guess what? Your wife and your husband ain't going to be there with you. You got to take authority over yourself. You got to stop worrying about what they doing over there and what they doing over there and what they doing over there. You got to stop worrying about what's going on in somebody else's house. Because this is an individual thing. And each and every last one of us are responsible for our own salvation. And you got to walk that thing with fear and trembling. Fear and trembling. Work out your own soul salvation. With fear and trembling. I'm going to say this and I'm going to move on. But God want me to tell each and every last one of you. He said, for so long, you have been hiding behind a name. I'm going to say it. For 42 years, you have been hiding behind a name, but a name won't get you into the kingdom. Amen. Saying I go to CWA won't get you there. Amen. Saying that you've been up under Prophet Fred Hey, won't get you there. Saying you being up on the Apostle Helen won't get you there. Saying that you being up on the Pastor Frederick won't get you there. Yeah. Yeah. And the Lord showed me, he said, I had to allow some things to happen to prove to you that you cannot hide behind a name. You got to have some individual power. Oh, y'all don't want to hear me. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, some, some preacher would say, no, you get your power from the church. Because they want your money. They don't want you to lay hands on yourself. They don't want you to have the power to speak life over yourself. Because they want you to go to them. And so that you can give them a little a piece of money. Give them a little piece of money. You can do that. You know, I'm going to tell you something. You can, this is why the body of Christ so messed up. This is why every fulfillment of promise that God has given, we ain't getting it. Why? Because you got to have a plan. You cannot rely on a building to give you power. You cannot rely on a name to give you power. Being under put of my daddy or me or my mother, they don't give you power. We were called to equip you. But for so long, thus says the Lord, for so long you've been trying to pull on the anointing that we have. Instead of getting to that place where God says, no, I need you to have individual power. We are just here to equip you. We are here to bring knowledge and understanding. We are here to give instruction and give a plan. But you can't hide behind us no more. You can't hide behind the building no more. You can't hide behind the name. God put a stop to all of that. He said, since we've been praying that it happened like that, he said, I will force it. 
The Lord said, I will force it. 